Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to talk about Karen Nyamu biography. Her full name is Karen Jerry Nyamu. Karen is a practicing lawyer in Kenya. Her law firm is called Jerry Nyamu and co advocates located at ICEA Building, 17th Kenyatta Avenue, Nairobi. She is also a member of the board of directors of the Nairobi Water and Sewage Company. She was an unsuccessful aspirant of the Nairobi County Women Representative in 2017. Karen does not have a husband. Her love life is very controversial and is known to change men regularly. So no man can be said to be her husband. Having no head a stable man in her life, Karen has one adorable daughter who she go together with DJ Kevin and a son whom she go together with Samido by the end of 2020. According to Snoops, Karen sleeps with filthy rich men, milks them dry, and then goes for her next target. In 2020, Karen alleged that she and Samuel Muchoki aka Samido are expecting a child together. Fans of Samido, however, doubt this narrative. However, Samido came out to dispel the rumors that he is the baby daddy. But in late February 2021, Karen had a public attackation with Samido over him and not recognizing her son. She demanded that Samido recognize her son and indeed that came to be. She however apologized to Samido's wife for coming to rock her marriage. I'm really sorry for the anguish that I may have caused you all along. I thought you knew because your husband told me you knew. No excuses. I'm really sorry for everything. Karen said. Karen is said to have had an affair with wealthy city businessman Jacob Juma, but the affair lasted for two months before she dumped him for deputy president William Ruto. After William Ruto got hold of Karen from Jacob Juma, a very heated exchange ensued between Jacob Juma and William Ruto over some money to build the Moi Teaching and Referral Hospital in Eldoret. Kenyans thought it was a financial scandal, but it wasn't. It was a booty scandal. Karen is also alleged to have an affair with Anthony Kongu, the chairman of the Betting Control and Licensing Board and a shareholder of Sport Pesa. Being a smart lawyer, Karen confused Anthony Kongu with love and transferred a plot of land in Mudaiga Estate to her name. The lawyer was smart enough to clear all processes at the Ministry of Lands as Kongu unsuccessfully tried to recover the plot recently. Former Prime Minister Raila Odinga's late son, Fidel Odinga, was also having an affair with Karen behind his wife's back. Anthony Kongu went to Karen's house in Kilimani Apartments only to find the late Fidel Odinga rest in peace at her house. The two refused to open the door for him. He shot in the air out of frustration, much to the panic of neighbors in their Kilimani Apartments. Police were called and Anthony Kongu was subdued. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe, like, comment and share for more videos on celebrity profile and lifestyle.